Charles had always been fascinated by the supernatural and the unknown. As a child, he would spend hours poring over books on ghosts, monsters, and other mysterious creatures. So when he stumbled upon an old dusty glass bottle buried in his backyard, he knew he had to investigate. As he dug up the bottle, he noticed that it was a beautiful dark green color with intricate patterns etched onto its surface. Curiosity getting the better of him, Charles opened the bottle and peered inside. Suddenly, a small glowing insect emerged from the darkness, landing on the ground next to the bottle. Charles was taken aback by this strange occurrence and decided to investigate further. He carefully picked up the bug and examined it, marveling at its iridescent wings. As he did so, the bug suddenly transformed into a small wispy creature with eyes that seemed to gleam with an otherworldly intelligence. Shocked and fascinated, Charles placed the creature back in the bottle and watched as it disappeared into the darkness once more. He couldn't shake off the feeling that something mysterious was happening, and he found himself returning to the bottle again and again, hoping to catch a glimpse of the strange bug or uncover its secrets. As the days passed, Charles began to notice odd changes occurring around his house. Things would move on their own, objects would disappear only to reappear in strange locations, and he would catch whispers of eerie whispers in the wind. He grew more and more convinced that the bottle was the source of these strange happenings, and he became obsessed with uncovering its secrets. One night, Charles decided to confront the mysterious forces at work within the bottle. He carefully opened it once again, his heart racing with anticipation, and was met with a burst of glowing light that enveloped him entirely. When the light faded, he found himself in a strange ethereal realm filled with twisting vines, glowing mushrooms, and creatures unlike any he had ever seen before. As he explored this mystical landscape, Charles encountered a wise old being who revealed to him that the bottle was once used by ancient sorcerers to contain a powerful, otherworldly creature. The bug he had found was actually a messenger from this creature, sent to awaken Charles to its presence and to invite him on a journey of discovery and transformation. Charles was both terrified and thrilled at the prospect of embarking on such an adventure, and he knew that his life would never be the same again. He thanked the old being and returned to his own world ready to face whatever lay ahead with courage and wonder. But as he returned home, Charles couldn't shake off the feeling that the bottle was still exerting some kind of influence over him. He began to notice strange symbols etched into the walls of his house, and he would catch glimpses of the wispy creature darting around the corners of his room. He knew that he had only scratched the surface of the mysteries contained within the bottle, and he couldn't wait to see what other secrets it held. What was Charles fascinated by as a child? As a child, Charles was fascinated by books on ghosts, monsters, and other mysterious creatures. What did Charles find in his backyard that sparked his curiosity? Charles found an old dusty glass bottle buried in his backyard that sparked his curiosity. What happened when Charles opened the bottle for the first time? When Charles opened the bottle for the first time, a small glowing insect emerged from the darkness and landed on the ground next to the bottle. What did Charles notice as he explored the mystical realm? As Charles explored the mystical realm, he noticed strange symbols etched into the walls, glowing mushrooms, twisting vines, and creatures unlike any he had ever seen before. How did Charles feel as he returned home after his journey through the bottle? Charles couldn't shake off the feeling that the bottle was still exerting some kind of influence over him as he returned home, and he began to notice strange symbols etched into the walls of his house and catch glimpses of the wispy creature darting around the corners of his room. He knew that he had only scratched the surface of the mysteries contained within the bottle and couldn't wait to see what other secrets it held.